our second senior, number 21, Kara Bike. My lasting legacy would be to be a good person, worry about the people around you, be aware of their feelings, how can you help them. It's kind of putting yourself second, but also taking care of yourself, your mental health. There's times you have to put yourself first, um, but always have the team in mind. Family is definitely the first word that comes to mind with this program. That was one of the huge reasons I chose here, and for my first visit, that was a given, just the relationship the girls have with our coaching staff. Field hockey, obviously, is a huge part of why we're all here, but the relationships and the growth of each other, that's the family aspect that comes into it, and that's huge. I am the youngest of five siblings, three boys. My sister was the oldest, so the boys were sandwiched in between us. Family was very important growing up to me. I think it made me who I am as a person today. I credit it completely to my family. We definitely wanted to play sports as children. We were always outside, always active. My parents both played sports growing up. It was kind of like a given, like get them involved, get them outside. We were all very much involved in our youth programs, whether it was soccer, t-ball, baseball. Uh, my brothers with football. My dad was a coach for my brothers, so that was kind of a way of giving back to the youth programs. Community service was really important to my family, giving back to our community, whether it was through youth programs or just in general, my hometown. Volunteering time with kids in the community or a peer mentoring program. We volunteered with the life skills students in my high school, stuff like that. So that was really important to me and I knew that coming into college, I wanted to continue that with the Lansing community. She's a natural leader, like she's someone on the field, she's a natural leader. Off the field, she looks after people. She's involved in SAC, she's involved in the DLC on campus. She's involved in a lot of community outreach. So I think that's something that she's passionate about, she cares about, it's not forced upon her. She doesn't force it upon other people, but I think she inspires others to want to give back and also, you know, understand the impact you can have on others that are less fortunate. So it's something that's been ingrained in her through her life and she's continued on here. And I think it's something that at Michigan State, we, we have those opportunities for our student athletes. And she's really just jumped in the two feet and gone with it. One of the major community service projects that we do a year is Teams for Toys. It's around Christmas time. And basically two teams join together and raise money to support a family within the Lansing community. We also take part in wrapping the gifts as a team and there's a day we do in the middle of finals, a nice little break from studying and you get to wrap gifts. Kind of bring that burden off of Christmas time and give gifts for kids on Christmas and Christmas morning they have a whole wrapping of gifts to open up. My schedule is very busy and just like every other student athlete here, we're always doing things but Making time for community service and all the other things I'm involved in is important to me. It's, it's what grows the people around you. Hey, watch Jen. Watch out. Jen got that strong defense. I can still remember the day she committed and we were super excited. And I think Kara has someone that she's exceeded expectations. I mean, you never know with people what you're going to get when they come in. But Kara is someone that has embodied everything about this program and has grown and developed every single year. Um, I think that's what we saw in her just as a high school athlete coming into college. You're only as great as the people around you and I'm so privileged to have the life I live, to have the family I have, to the support system and you can only wish other people can feel that love and feel that support so I think that's one main reason why I enjoy giving back and I enjoy caring for the people around me and just volunteering my time any way I can.